will limit the currency effect that, of course, will use transportation costs because tra today the transportation costs we, we pay from uh, somewhere in China coming here. Today we just have to pay the truck and you know that this is cheaper than the containers. So Fago will have benefits, of course. Sure. As, uh, as, uh, as I was mentioning before, I mean, we are, from an industrial perspective, we are already a European uh, manufacturer. We have you know, uh, seven out of eight uh, manufacturing plants in Europe. But, as I was saying, we are mainly a European player. Meaning that we are playing most of our activities, even though the seven, more than 75% is outside of Spain, mainly in Europe. So, uh, when I was talking about the complementarity, what higher will bring us is the possibility of boosting our sales in the Asian markets. In addition to that, what comes as a normal result is that our brand image and awareness will increase by itself. And uh, René was mentioning, and I think it's just another class of the application of the scales of the economy, I mean, we are going to be improving our competitiveness. Competitiveness in the sense that, I mean, cost will be reduced, product will be improved and we are going to be also improving this competitiveness as I was saying. So pretty much in line with our strategic approach since uh, for the period 2013-2016 which, which is based on business alliances for growing with the international internationalization as one of the key levers and sustainable development. This is also a key matter for us because it's not about getting everything from very far away with the cost, with the impact on the environment, is also about being efficient, about having the closer possible key manufacturing plants to the markets in which we are present. So, so as a as a conclusion, so what we can say, I will confirm its interest for European markets. Of course. Because uh, for me, is, uh, and for the whole the higher team which is here with me, it's very important that our headquarters accept to invest in a factory in Europe. It means that headquarters is confident in the European market. Well, we are confident with the team, I don't know, you will ask to them. But uh, I think that it's a good sign that higher invest on the European market now, even if the crisis is still here, but everybody is confident in the fact that we are able to increase our market share, to be profitable, and to continue, continue to, to confirm our interest from the European market, keep moving to our goal. Our goal is definitively to be the top five manufacturer. We, we said this since the beginning. I told this at the first press conference in 2010. Some of you were here. And we confirmed this, that we want to go there. What is important for Haya is that we move to what we call the three dimension strategy in Europe. R&D, local. We have our local R&D. Factory local, now we have our factory for cooling. And marketing and sales local, which is the team. Which is so we continue and we are consistent in our, our way. From a uh, perspective, I think it's quite clear. We consolidate our strategy for being a global player. I was saying we are European today. This will help us to get in global. Uh, and also will help us, as I was saying, on thanks to the size, the increase of the size, being much more competitive. And uh, being competitive, having the good competitiveness level in this market is key because the market is not any more local, it's global. And what higher will bring us, and this joint venture will uh, bring us, is the possibility to improve this competitiveness, but overall, get global. Pass from being a European player to a global player. Thank you. Thank you, Sergio. Thanks. Thanks, Tony. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, Emma, the, you must be 25 minutes to have just on time. Time. sharp on time. <laughs> So that's uh, questions. questions. Yeah, please feel free. Right, I've got a microphone because Deborah wants to work. Hello, I'm from Poland and I got a question about your expanding operations. So we'll be expanding the Fabro factory in Wrocław 
And uh, what will happen to the master cook? Will the master cook brand uh, disappear? And uh, will the, the refrigerators produced in the factory in Toronto will be marked as master cook, higher, or what? So, yeah, I, I will answer. Uh, as, uh, as we were saying, this is an industrial cooling generation. So it's, this is not a brand or commercial generation. So uh, Fagora, Master Cook, the Master Cook brand, which is a main, the main asset we have in the Polish market, will remain uh, belonging to Fagora, will remain Master Cook. And the appliances that will be manufactured in this uh, new JV will be branded higher, Fagor, Master Cook, the Dietrich brand. I mean, all the brands portfolio that both groups we do have inside our companies. So no change with relation to that. It's just an industrial GED, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Okay.
succeed together to build a factory with one million pieces, I can tell you that one million unit is not existing in Europe today. Nobody has one million factory units. So after this, of course, cooperation will be opened more and more. That will, for me and for Fado, I say. So it's just to make it simple, if we're running, we need to learn to work together. Mm -hmm. So we will see how, uh, as Rene was saying, mm -hmm. it will work. I mean, both companies, uh, we have been uh, working since the last couple of years to get here. We will see later on. I mean, if uh, everything goes well, we can try to find some other areas of cooperation today. This is the area of cooperation. Will, will cooling will be for us win-win agreement because both parties will have benefits. <coughs> There is a strong competition, especially in the production capability in Europe, with the LG and Samsung both owning big factories in uh, Poland. How do you want to compete on the European market with the Korean players who are becoming the threat to the, uh, the, 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 the... They are existing like others. So we need to consider, of course, that they are very strong. We need to consider that they have made huge investment three years ago, four years ago in Poland. So now they have the industry capability. So they are players, we are players. Now it's uh, us to show that uh, our product will be good, our competitiveness will be good, our design will be good. We need to do our job uh, normally, but without, again, what I said, without the factory facility, it's not the same game, it's not the same game. Fortunately, but, uh, there is Samsung, there is LG that help us to be better. Uh, so I think having the competition is not, not a bad thing, it's a good thing. Yeah, so um, uh, we have been manufacturing since uh, many years, cooling, I think, in, in Poland, and uh, they have been there. I mean, now I'm pretty convinced about our capacities. When I mean our capacities, I mean higher and power ones to make uh, a very nice battle when it comes to cooling. So we have industrial power, as Vanny was saying, we, now, we have the technical knowledge, and we have the markets. So, I mean, the, as René was saying, competition is there, and we we are pretty, uh, we are uh, ready, we are uh, very happy to, to, to fight in the market. Eric, Eric, you on your mic, friends. How many products, uh, cooling products, do you sell in Europe? Each, each uh, one, actually. Uh, what is the, the total number of Cooling products of the European markets. And uh, for higher, uh, you said that you have a, a plant in Italy. Uh, where does come from the other product? All from the um, factory in, uh, in China or Asia? Or? So today, from higher side, we have a factory in Campodoro in Italy. Uh, of course, we have our first factory, which is uh, near 2000, 1000 factory, which is a big factory, more than, more than 1.5 million. And as we have a factory facility in Thailand, so, Thailand, where we make the big size top mount. Uh, so this is the, what we are doing. So today, of course, uh, our target, what I, what I say, is that regarding Europe, more than 50% of the total volume for higher will come from the will come from this factory. This is, a, this is our target. So it, it will be huge. And of course, more and more the factory will grow. More and more, we will have product coming from this factory, which is normal because we invest in this, in this target. Well, when it comes to flour, I mean, we are producing in both uh, in Spain, Poland, and the uh, total volumes that we produce is around about 500,000 units. For the old main, again, the European market. But of course, we need, we need to increase our production capacity and we need to improve our product. When the product will be more and more improved, after, of course, the business will be uh, opening to us because if we have good product, I think we can be successful. Always what I say, the product is the most important in the life of 